I'm Fox Force Colton Chavez, and I want to start by asking you the question, would you feel safe walking up and down these roads to get home? But before you answer that, come with me. Because families who have children who go to nearby schools here in North Fort Myers tell me because they live too close to the school, they no longer get a bus stop. I have two children. So that's crazy. Yeah, could you imagine a little kid walking by that? Kathy Shimko says that's her fear. Now that she says her grandchildren's bus route was eliminated from North Fort Myers Academy for the Arts. Kathy says she found out at the start of the school year. And I asked one of the gentlemen that worked at the school, would you walk that neighborhood? He said, absolutely not. That's why I don't live there. The route that they want them to take goes over a goes around a, a blind turn. Stephanie, who preferred to keep her face off camera, has two children who go to school in North Fort Myers. The Lee County School District says students don't get a bus if they live within two miles of their school. To change that, the district says they must have a disability or the walk home must have hazardous walking conditions for a bus to be provided. They like to do burnouts around that corner right there, and that's my children's bus stop right there at that dead end sign pretty much. Stephanie says last year, the two mile rule to ride the bus did not exist. So after hearing their concerns, I reached out to the school district of Lee County. A spokesperson tells me that the district is now aware of the safety concerns and is reviewing the situation to determine if busing can be restored. I won't believe anything until until I see it. <laughs> A skeptical outlook that families who live in North Fort Myers hope will come true. It's just ridiculous. Like, give us our buses back. A spokesperson for the school district says a decision could be made by next week. Reporting in North Fort Myers. These kids deserve it. Colton Chavez, Fox 4.